what happened. This is not right. Uh, what a freaking night. All right, a few things I want to get off my chest. A lot of Mandela effect. A lot of simulated reality. We are in a simulated reality. Consciously, we're here. But other than that, we have people a thousand years from now looking back in their past to see how they got to where they're at now. And they created what we are now all doing. You ever have deja vu? You ever go, wow, I either dreamed that or that happened. Somewhere in my mind that happened. That's what you call a glitch. The glitch happens when something is changed. Something changed and that's now part of your reality. I've been looking a lot into this and it really makes sense that we could be simulated. And one day we will simulate the same thing once we reach that level of uh, technology or whatever we're doing here. I know it seems unfathomable, unbelievable, not real. Look at me. Do I look like I'm serious? I, I hope and pray that something different is other than simulated because I surely do smell, taste, feel, feel, see everything that's around me but we play video games and they're pretty real with inside what they're doing so a thousand years from now who's to say that we can't create something this real this every little thing has been programmed in to get to the point to where they're at so they can see what happened. And then this whole 2012 thing, I've been hearing that the world did end on 2012, the world that we used to know. If you've noticed, things have changed. We still are living, just consciously things have changed and we've either split dimensions or we did leave the earth that we knew and we're on a different one. It's pretty wild. It'll blow your mind. And being simulated doesn't mean that we're not real. We are as real as the creator created us. We think, we move, and we feel emotions. So I don't know what I'm trying to say other than we should just live whatever we've been given and live to the fullest. And I believe that we can control this world with our brain, our mind that we've been given. We are the one. We are the one. You just got to know how to open up that portal inside your head. All the things that have been happening, all the little things that uh, come into play where you start thinking, well, I don't remember that. That's not the way I remembered it. It's exactly the way it was supposed to be. We just choose to believe things the way we want to believe them. And we think we're exactly right all the time. And that's just not the case. We are not right all the time. Things are the way they are because that's the way they are. And I don't know if I, I... I don't know. It just stumbles you, doesn't it? It just... If you really think about it, everything is zeros and ones. Zero... Me, 
putting this onto this device is nothing but capturing zeros and ones. Just something to think about. Um, wouldn't it make sense, though, that in technology you would want to look back to see how you got to where you were at? 10,000 years here on Earth could only be 10 minutes to someone 1,000 years into our future. It's just something to think about. Maybe I'm wrong. Just a thought.